What's up everyone, it's Kyle, and welcome back to another episode of U Pops. I'm here today with my sister after going on a three-store Funko Pop haul, and we can't wait to show you what we got, so stay tuned. So the first place that we went to was Walmart. Um, we had yet to go to that place before, and when we got there, there was a minimal selection. What do you think about their selection? Yeah, it sucked. I was kind of sad. I was actually really excited to go to Walmart, but no, not this time. But we did find two while we were there, and the first one we'll show you is Cole from Mortal Kombat. It's actually from the most recent Mortal Kombat film from 2021. It came out in April. And let's show you the pop a little bit right there. Try not to get in the light. It's a really cool pop, and I actually got her the Sonya Blade one too in yeah, the series. Yeah, I love that one. There's Scorpion and Sub Zero, so four in total in this one. I purchased this pop for $9.99. It's listed on Pop Price Guide for $10, so it's a penny increase. It's almost too negligible to even mention, but it's a great pop to add to the collection. It's the first one I have in the Mortal Kombat series, and I can't wait to add more. The only other Funko pop that we got while we were there is this enormous 10 inch zombie magneto we got this pop for 29 dollars and 96 cents it's listed on pop price guide for 35 dollars which is a nice increase of 16 percent so it's nice to get anywhere over 10 percent but once again i got this more because of how cool it was and not really for yeah it's super awesome exactly and in the back uh it has Zombie Hulk, Wolverine, Deadpool, and Black Panther. The second place we went to was Best Buy, and uh, the selection was uh, not very good either. Minimal? Yeah, like, it was minimal. Like, it was bare shelf after bare shelf, and just really on the top, maybe two shelves they had Funko yeah. Pops, and what was it, like a lowly minion at the bottom? Yeah, yeah I'm just really not nothing. into minions, sorry. No, I've seen the yeah. movies, but uh, only with girlfriends, so yeah, not... Not ones that I would go for myself. But what we did find was Emperor Palpatine. So let's grab that. This is Emperor Palpatine. There's five total in this series. We got Ben Solo, Ray with Yellow Lightsaber, Ray with Cross Lightsaber, and Babu Frick. Is that right? <sighs> Babu Frick. Okay, I guess Babu Frick. It's very detailed. Like, yeah, you it see is. How it's cool. really cool. And then it it's got really the little cool. Star Wars, like, kind of stand on Oh, yeah, on. that's the yeah. other thing I like about all the Star Wars related ones. They're actually on the base. Every mm -hmm. single one of them has the base with the Star Wars symbol which on it, so, really cool. which is really yeah. cool. The last place we went to was a comic shop that's close to my house. We had never been there before. Yeah, I actually just was, like, looking up different Funko places and we found it. So the first one that we got when we were there was D from Always Sunny. This is from the episode when Charlie writes a play because he's trying to impress the waitress. It's actually the Nightman Cometh. And what else is in here is Dennis, Mac, Charlie, and Frank as a troll. Have you ever seen this episode? I think you showed it to me a long time ago, but we should watch it again so I can kind of refresh Yeah, well, let's watch it after this. Yeah. This is actually a really hilarious episode. Yeah, let's see that. Last one that we got was Wonder Woman. It's not any type of exclusive or anything like a Hot Topic or a Target exclusive, but it's definitely a really intricate pop. I like her with the helmet, the gold helmet and the yeah. shield. What do you think about it? Yeah, I just think all of the Wonder Woman ones in general are like really cool. This one's really cool as well, and it's got the other two on there that are- Oh yeah, I didn't show the other ones. Yeah. The Mod and the Secret Agent, so. That's really cool. And that's not that many in this set. That'd yeah. be almost easy to get. Complete. So hopefully we do complete it. Oh, and also at the comic book shop, we found this other figure that she can explain to you better. So it's uh, Angel from Buffy the Vampire Slayer. And the actual maker is Vin Vinimates? Vinimates? It's a vinyl figure. Vinimates? Vinimates. I have no idea. Um, <laughs> I've never heard of this before, but I just thought it was awesome because it's Buffy the Vampire Slayer. But there's there's two other um, characters in the set. That's there's cool. Buffy the Vampire Slayer, obviously, and then Spike. They actually have two other ones. They have um, Spike and Angel together. It is a San, San Diego Comic-Con exclusive um, that I want to order online because they actually have it. You totally and should. then they have another um, Buffy that's a, an exclusive where she's wearing a different outfit. So... I definitely want to order those two as well because they're super cool. And even though this is not Funko Pop related, this is still another cool collectible that I think people might be interested yeah, in. It's awesome. Thank you for watching another episode. I'm glad you got to see my sister and all the new Funkos that we got. And I had a great time showing them to you. Look forward to more episodes in the future. Have a good rest of your day.